Good morning, guys. I was planning to wake up at 7.30 and it's currently 10.30 and I'm a little bit sick. Oh, I hate myself. Just kidding, I love myself. <laughs> Okay, so now I'm about to have my breakfast. I have my iced coffee, which is one of my favorite. And then I have a muesli with some chia seeds. Man, I don't know if you can see it. Ah! Oh, While I'm having my breakfast, I decided to active recall a bit of biology using the notion. And I'm gonna answer a bunch of questions that I made in the past. Active recall is one of the most effective study methods. If you don't know about active recall or if you have never heard about active recall, I can make a video about it, but Ali Abdal has a video about it. You can watch that as well. So as you can see, I have like the whole bunch of topics here. Today I'm gonna do the circulatory system. When you click the toggle feature, the answer appears and like you just basically answer all of them. I know the Anki as well, but firstly I study with Notion and if I repeatedly get that wrong, I do it with Anki. And in 20 minutes I have a Zoom meeting, so I have to be real quick. My Zoom meeting is cancelled, so I have a bit of time and I have the Zoom meeting at 2 p.m. So I have two hours. I think I will study a bit biology. A lot of you guys want to know why I'm studying biology and chemistry and stuff, even though I'm taking a break from med uni. One day, I hope I can explain it. I don't know. So yeah, let's study. I went to the toilet for a quick little break, but then I found myself watching YouTube videos, like very random ones, for 15 minutes. So I just rushed and came back to my desk and yeah <laughs> oh i don't know i just cannot focus really well today ah but yeah i got back to studying peace whenever i got bored when i'm studying i usually like play some classic musics to entertain myself and i listen to like classic musics and work for 10 minutes or so and then i get into my zone once again and then i stop the music and i also have like this mini fan that i use because my room is freaking hot i have air conditioner in my room but i'm since i'm a little bit sick it's not a good idea to turn the air condition on like i got this from a supermarket and this was only like 12 liras because it was on sale 12 liras is i think one dollar less than two dollars and now let's turn my fan mini fan and let's go back to studying and by the way i'm not this productive normally when i film vlogs i become more productive because i know that somebody's watching me and i think it's a good thing because it overall increases my productivity and i can motivate you guys and yeah, so I think it's a win-win situation for both of us. Niye sana verdiniz? Okay, so uh, my Zoom meeting has ended. Now I have about one hour until the PTYA starts. PTYA is Part-Time YouTuber Academy, which is Ali Abdal's course for those who are aspiring to become YouTubers or already like intermediate YouTubers and advanced YouTubers, whatever that means. I have a little bit of time until then, so I decided to spend this time productively. And I'm currently watching the Ali Abdal Skillshare class about how to study for exams and evidence-based masterclass. If you didn't watch this class, I would highly, highly recommend you to watch Ali Abdal's course. It's, it's so freaking good and I really love Skillshare and I watch a bunch of courses from them because rather than spending time on YouTube, 
like on Skillshare you get more valuable information that you wouldn't get on YouTube so if you want to spend your time productively but still enjoy and learn something then Skillshare is like perfect way to do it I, I, it just sounds so sponsorish but this video is not sponsored by Skillshare I just I just love Skillshare itself we have a session called performative speaking how to be a better speaker now i'll join that and yes that is not actually true i literally wasted solid 30 minutes of my life on youtube by watching jeffrey star videos like why i did that I started with like a body body like gesture analogist video analyzing Dr. Mike's apology video and I started from that video and I went to like I don't know then I watched like couple Jeffree Star videos in double speed and I got entertained by the comment section then I realized that I'm wasting my life so I stopped watching it, but I wasted solid 30 minutes of my life watching Jeffree Star YouTube videos. Ah. And yeah, so by watching Jeffree Star YouTube videos, the only thing that I learned is how rich he is. <laughs> so yeah, that was it. That was that was a bad 30 minute. But yeah, oh, it happens. Like it happens, you know. Important thing is the majority. Like in Atomic Habits by James Clear, he says that every action is a vote. A single vote doesn't mean anything. Majority determines who you are, what type of person you are. Just because you did something unproductive like for months, you won't become an unproductive person. But if you continue to keep voting on productive actions, the majority will be productive so that you become a productive person that's the kind of perspective that i have so whenever i do something unproductive i don't feel that much guilty about of it i just continue whatever i'm supposed to do so that i can change the majority and become the person who i want to be so that's the kind of like a thing that i learned from atomic habits i'll add the link down in the description below but yeah read that book it's amazing i also have like a video which I'll attach here. You can watch it there as well. I think I'll make myself a cup of coffee and then start studying. And yeah, I'll check my schedule once more because I think I have another meeting at 9 p.m. or so, or 10 p.m., I'm not really sure. Yes, 10 p.m. So yeah, see you soon. Oh, it's not like These days, I'm literally in a slump. I don't, I don't realize how time passes. I just do the random things. A lot of people think that I'm all the time productive, but not at all. Like, for example, today, I only studied for three hours. I was planning to study like for 6, but it's currently like 9 p.m. and I only say 3 hours and I like woke up today at 10.30 I was planning to wake up at 7 I don't know, maybe... maybe I'm just in a slump it's pretty normal but like when I look at to Ali Abdal or Nasser Karma they're like all the time, you know, productive and when I just like compare myself to them, I just feel like... Huh. <laughs> I don't know if it happens with you guys as well. No offense to those people, I really admire both of them, Ali and Nasser. I'm like in Ali's PTYA course. PTYA, Ali Abdal's course, is we're like about 200 participants, I guess. And they divided those participants into different houses. And there you meet like with 10 people, I guess, every single week. And you have a housemaster who is another YouTuber. And my housemaster is Nasser Karma, Karma Medic. And the course is from Ali Abdal. It's just like a dream come true. 
I like every single week when like I'm talking with Nasser, I'm just like so fangirling because Nasser and Ali are just like my favorite. Ah, oh, and why I'm smiling. So he's down to earth. He gets his work done. He does all of these things like the studying, his personal life. You know, when I look to Nasser and Ali, and when I compare myself to them, I'm just like, oh, Rudy, you're not enough, you're not enough. Like, there is always constant toes in my mind saying that, Rudy, you're not enough at all. And yeah, <laughs> I don't know if people feel like that, but for those who are thinking that I'm always productive, I'm not at all. Like, I, I for me, I'm the I'm the most potato person ever. I'm just like not productive at all. The reason why I love like consuming productivity is it's just like different tactics and tricks and I try them and I definitely think that I grew so much from them. Like a lot of people say that like hustle culture or something, but I don't think it's a hustling. Like being productive means you get your shit done in order to make time for the things that you care. So, you know, I want to become productive, not because I want to like do more stuff, because I want to make time for the things that I truly care. For example, like exercising or reading or making YouTube videos, like, you know, but most of my days, I just like spend my day like potato-y. Um, maybe it's like productive for someone, but for me personally, it's not enough. Like I accept myself, but it doesn't mean that I'm not gonna grow. I accept my like circumstance right now, but I don't like say myself, okay, it's okay, that's me and stuff. I say like, okay, today was a potato-ish day, but we will try tomorrow again. And I'm just aiming to do one person improvement. And I, 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 I first met like with Ali Abdul three years or maybe two years ago. And I started to watch his videos and my perspective to life literally changed from there i started to like really become more and more and more productive little by little but i think it definitely like changed my whole perspective and how i spend my day productivity is sort of a journey in my opinion you won't become a productivity master in a day yeah you start slowly grow and grow and grow and yeah i think i think i'm much better when you compare to two years ago but Sometimes I feel like this is not enough, but I stop that like totes and say it's okay. One person improvement, atomic habits, don't forget that. And I just like calm down myself and I try to make, make the day count. I don't know why am I giving this random teddy talky, teddy talky? <laughs> I don't know why I'm rumbling today that much. Maybe because I want to procrastinate, but yeah. I made myself a cup of tea. Uh, we have the house party that I mentioned in 45 minutes. I think I'll do a little bit of productive stuff. Like I'll check my mails, I respond to them. And also I'll plan what I'll be doing. And yeah, I said that I'll be planning maybe a couple of times, but I didn't. So I should be doing those things. Now, we don't say I should do this or I have to. We say I want to. I want to check my mails and I want to respond to them. I want to, I want to, I want to study. I truly want to study. Okay, I think it's okay right now. 